Uh, welcome back everyone. This is AC taking you through a world of Final Fantasy. And we're just continuing on from where we left off. Hopefully this is the end of the bridge. Chapter 17. Not but nightmares. It's night. <gasps> the moon is the so pretty! So, uh, are we really sure there's a key around here? Well, I am getting some seriously intense not but night vibes from the place. I say we go to check out that town in the distance. The one with the light on. Hey, is that... Uh, the, uh, train? Oh wow, is that the Doom Train? We haven't seen that for a long time. Uh -huh. Guys, are we sure this thing's safe? Looks like a one-way ticket to, uh, you know. Tickets, please! <laughs> it's just the conductor! Oh, then this must be the same train as the always! Huh? The conductor? Yes! In all my succulentious glory! What? Why did you scare me? But, miss, you were practically begging for a good heart stopper. Ask and you shall receive, I say. What kind of stupid, messed up logic is that? Zip! Uh, stop doing that! Uh, zip, zip! Uh, Would you cut that out? Uh, zip, zip, zip! Uh, Just let me hit you! Zippity zip! Zip! <laughs> Fifty odd years of cactuaring! I'd say I know a thing or two about dodging. <laughs> Come and get me. Get back here, you prickly pop! <laughs> um, sis? <sighs> um, Rain, are you a pop? Yeah, I still got it. Yeah, well, you don't have to give it to me! <laughs> you better keep practicing, little giant girl. Can't touch this cat bar. One of these days, I'm gonna get you for this! Okay, we're kind of getting off track. That's for the sure. A quick look up here. Right, tickets, please. Go on, then, all aboard. Some kind of museum. <clears throat> hey, hold up. I know. An anchor. The Federation must have controlled this place. Let's be careful.
Absolutely zero use for this. Well, you never were too keen on the printed word. I doubt anyone's gonna be burning through any paperbacks in this light. Hmm. The town is awfully dark. I mean, I know it's the land of naught but night, but it's still too early for the town to be sleeping, right? Yeah. There should be more people around if you ask the me. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Hey, are you okay? <laughs> huh? What's the matter? Huh? What? Come on. Can you keep up? Yes. Yeah. Yes, sir. Finally makes his appearance. So he went to the right. <clears throat> Okay, let's go. Probably some hidden books you can read around here, surely. Oh, mirages we can handle. Yeah, no sweat. Okay, time to savage our reputation. All the right, let's the savage it. Or incompetent. Oh, whatever. Savage away. <clears throat> I think we have a werebat. Yeah, we don't have the vampire though. Need a dark attack. A mirage with sharp fangs that don't just suck blood, they drip venom too. One great reason to never get bitten by a vampire is because you'll end up looking like this. Fakes a heavy Transylvania, Transylvanian accent, also sparkles when no one's looking. Keepers? Right. 
the giants from the hills. Ta-da! That's us! Point us at mirages and watch the magic. <laughs> if that's the case, then come with me. So, who are they? Celeste, these kids are the giants from the hills. You don't mean from the prophecy. Um, you think you could fill us in on what's been going on here? Sure. Where to begin? Anchor appeared out of nowhere, then the Mirages? Yeah. The League of S sent me here. I was supposed to just be investigating the Anchor. But by the time he arrived, the vampires were already running amok. I'm told that it was utter chaos. Um, you didn't see it? I'm a hired sword, and my job in Tometown is to guard this place, the Library of the Ancients. So rarely do I find myself stepping outside. And it's always quiet here. Nothing seemed amiss, at least not until the town had already been overtaken. Hey, Celeste, where's... Oh, he was over there re... Hmm. How strange. Sid? Are you here? Sid? If you don't answer me, I am going to burn all of these books. Wait, wait! Those ghastly threats are so unbecoming. Huh? Oh, the talking weird thing! So what if it's a mirage? I often wonder the same thing. How incredibly rude. I'm just as human as you. Just because I sometimes have a habit of... Bussy! Oh! Bussy! 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 Yes, he does have a habit of going haywire. And it's my job to calm him down. What? Calm him down? If anything, he looks more broken down than- I'm back! <laughs> yes, well, it's far harder to break than you'd think. Trust me. I'll thank you not to refer to yes, me as Lord. an- Yes, May we continue with our conversation now? Hmm? Oh, yes. Where were we? Oh, you're like a book freak. What did you do? Make a body that doesn't sleep just so you could keep reading forever? Oh, no, no, please, you have it very wrong. I prefer the term bibliophile, thank you very much. That's the part that's wrong? As I understand it, someone just happened to leave that body he's in lying around, and somehow his soul got embedded in it. His soul's in bed? Wow. <laughs> I guess in a way, you are human deep the down. Maybe his soul needs to I get told you I'm human in every conceivable way. <laughs> no, you really, really aren't. <laughs> and what about you then? You say you're the giants from the hills? Now that right there is the real stretch. I mean, what a hoot! Uh, what a what? Oh, <laughs> Tom is not an owl. I mean, it is an easy mistake, but wouldn't you assume she's a skunk or something first? <laughs> You don't have to be ashamed of people thinking you're skunky. Skunks are cool, okay? Time out. Wildlife coolness aside, could you not derail every conversation just because you don't know how to vocabulary? But rain? Vocabulary's not a verb. It is if I say so. I'll vocab any way I want to. So can it before I vocab you in the Larry. Ah, uh, I see now you're comedians. Bravo! Enough. We have more important things to discuss. Okay, let's get right down to it. Those people back there with the fangs? What is the deal with them? Wow, right down to business. Huh. Vampires. They used to be people like us. 
until a vampire bite turned them. Huh? Now wait. Don't tell me that people can turn into mirages. And, and they can't go back to the way they were? Oh, well, while we're going back, when I was younger and even handsomer, I... <gasps> I mean, uh... Oh, yes, I remember clearly now. According to several books I have read, those who have become vampires can be cured, provided the vampire that sucked their blood is vanquished before it's too late. So then, all we have to do is move fast and take out the vampires that did the biting? That's the basic idea. But of course, those vampires used to be just as human as their victims. So if we're not careful about it, wouldn't we end up sacrificing as many lives as we managed to save in the end? Although, we could always pick off the illiterate vampires first. You're not really living anyway if you've never known the comfort of a good book. Uh, no, I don't think that makes you eligible for a slaying. But, point taken, we can't save everyone. Then, dude, what are we supposed to do? What if we defeated the first vampire, the one who started the whole thing? The first? That's it. If you trace the epidemic back, there has to be a first. Yes. Let's call that one the Prime. If we defeat the Prime, then the rest... Hey, yeah! It should cause a ripple effect and fix everyone. We would be vanquishing the Bitey's Biter's Biter. What do you think? Will it work, Sid? Well, it hasn't been particularly long since the commotion started, so... Yes, I believe that it could. Excellent. What a plan! Did you follow that, Tama? What? Uh, of course I did! Uh, yeah, me too! I was just checking. Alright, so where can we find the Prime? Let's see. Cloud, when you fight the vampires off, have you noticed any patterns to where they seem to go? Hmm. I never gave it much thought, but now that you mention it, they always seem to retreat to the north. Ah, well, that points to one place. That's right. The graveyard with all the abandoned mirage trains. That's their lair. Then let's not waste any more time. We should go. Wait, Cloud. Who's going to help the townspeople? I have to stay here. You wouldn't want me to go bzzzzz and make a big old mess. Which is exactly the reason why I have to stay here. So, he's a big pain in the royal of Okay, putting aside how completely not funny that is, we can go to the graveyard for you, right? Huh? Uh, yeah. Vampire schmampire, you just go ahead and point us at any old mirage. And we'll have to do the rest! Hmm. All right then. I guess. Let's see what the Fable Giants can do. I'll take you to the graveyard. Just say the word. I'll be around. have a look around then looks like the great google library from final fantasy 14 maybe that's what they were going for take you to the graveyard. Just say the word. I'll be around. It looks like we have no choice but to go there first. Oh, what was that? Azure Prophecy 1461 Impelled by destiny, the giants from the hills shall mark upon history a new epoch. This dawn shall portend the awakening of the mediums, a reveal of souls. The haves and the haves not shall see their fates manifested and their natures revealed. And lo, it shall be Ragnarok again. At the end, an end 
that with the new champions will begin. To whom will this bring salvation? To whom? Prophecy 933 Demons they shall one day assuredly be called they might they might will be great two powers wielded as one the world will tremble before this diad and yet with their handiwork be evil or good at the end of their grand approach they shall lay themselves prostrate and become the foundation of peace a brief lie and enduring hope someone ever heard of death magic it can KO you in one shot no matter how many HP you have left scary stuff right but if you're unstacked you might be able to keep the damage to a minimum Here's a chest. Nineteenth of Amethyst, Mithril thirteen. I asked Dad if there was anything we could do to help Mum out, but he just laughed and said we were already being a big help by chipping in with the housework. Doesn't he get that I want Mum to work less? Azure Prophecy 14.2.2 When time begins its march anew, they shall return as visitors, giants from the hills of a world not our own. Upon Grimoire, they will wreak two divergent futures, one that brings salvation and the other ruin, an enigma to confound even the highest mind. Well, I think we've looked everywhere now, haven't we? In case it wasn't obvious, the town is still a big mess. I wish I could help you guys fight, but they need my help. Are you sure you'll be able to face the Prime on your own? I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I think you've seen by now we can handle ourselves. We got it covered. Yep. You just worry about the town. Will do. If things settle down, I'll come find you later. So, next stop, the train graveyard. You ready?
Here we are. Welcome to Vampire Land. Also, they don't live here alone. There are other things too. Be careful. Wow! Just now look at all these choo-choos! I'm definitely getting that graveyard vibe. It's like a ghost could pop out at any second. Oh my gosh, Lon! That is not funny at all! Nice Final Fantasy 7 nudge there. So, what's this way first? So that way is back to the li uh, library. Oh, we need to zap. Well, let's do a few transfigurations quickly. There, there's a lot of things we can do now. Let's transfigurate him. You can change to Kazua Beast. You can change to Minotaur. Ooh. So I wonder what the difference is here. Gargantua and Gargantrot. What is this one? Gargantua. Let's try that. Put him back. Quickly check some other things. This one could change to Mimic Queen. Be quite interesting. And we can change to Adamantois now. But I want to keep as a small one for now. We need to uh, zap, don't we? Oh, 
Okay. Let's quickly adjust my stack. Let's try this guy out. Wonder why he's different. Let's get the Minotaur. Let's try that out. Wow, that's what I call a lift. Nothing can surprise us now, huh? Hey, is that a ghost? Ah! Gotcha. Want me to turn this into a lawn graveyard? <laughs> no, thank you. Are we going to get any ghost fights? Alrighty, let's go. Come on, bring it. I think we already have one of these. Yeah, we have one. We just transfigured it. Two different giant cat cars. It's the same, that's the same board. going to need the smash ability as well now.
Because this guy, uh, he has smash. I think these lights might be some kind of puzzle to get the special enemy. So I think we'll leave it here guys. And next video we'll continue on. So thanks for watching and I hope you're enjoying. Please hit the like button and subscribe to help the channel. Until next time, take care.